Hello everyone, let's see how we can texture this canister in Sovisum Painter. Let's start with the first layer. Let's add the basic material, choose color, roughness, and metalness. Now let's add many different shades of the same color, lighter ones and other darker ones. Maybe more yellowish and bluish, sometimes with a subtle value. Which blended together using uh, textures like grunges, clouds, and there are many different styles to choose from. Uh, we do that to get variation not only for the base color, but you can do it also for roughness. Feel free to play with that. There are many artists that have good packs of textures to use. Some stuff for metals effect, like scratches and all types of details you can see in a metal texture, and others for wood, like grains, and so many more effects. Here I'm only using general grunges texture, nothing specific. I also used the leaks, since this canister should always have liquids inside. So it all depends on what you all actually need. I kept doing so for many layers, as you see. New layer, black mask, add fill. You can try many textures and play with the scale, tiles and contrast. To choose what you think works best. I added beside leaks, uh, scratches too, and some small bumps with subtle height, since it's a paint over metal. It's always useful to use levels. It's an empty layer with pass-through blending mode, allows you to control all underneath layers. In this case, I'm using it to change the base color uh, to increase contrast. You can also do the same for roughness, but just make sure that you picked roughness from the list instead of base color. And this will save you a lot of time instead of going through every layer to change the color to blend it better. I also needed to add rust and peels effect on top. Let's add some more scratches and make it more sticking out this time. stickers gives it identity to. To see how to add it in details, check my tutorial for adding stickers in Substance Painter, link is added below. It's important to also think of the level of damage you are aiming to achieve. For example, for this cutting torch I expect damage and oxidation and dirt to be a little more intense. At the end, I hope you liked it. Let me know if you like it or at the end, I hope you liked the video. Let me know. At the end, I hope you liked the video.
at the end i hope you liked the video let me know if you have any comments thanks for watching see you next time